Open Buildings Designer 2023 incorporates platform updates from MicroStation 2023.1. A significant interface enhancement is now available, a new geospatial context workflow. It empowers users to seamlessly integrate geospatial context into designs through direct integration with Esri ArcGIS REST Map and Esri ArcGIS REST Feature Services. Users can access the Geographic Coordinate System tool and activate Bing Maps. They have the capability to apply various map types to different views. Please note that Update 2023 showcases both commercially released features and some in its technology preview mode. The technology preview allows you to test functionalities and provide feedback during the development process leading up to our product releases. This release introduces the Recents tab in the Commands pop-up. Recognizing that users spend considerable time on repetitive functions, this feature enables easy access to recently used commands, ultimately saving time and enhancing productivity and workflows. The new tab can be found within the current pop-ups dialog, accessed by hitting the spacebar when the mouse is pointed in the view. The Recents tab retains the memory of the last five tools used in the session, resetting when the session ends. Significant enhancements have been made in the Table Style Manager dialog. It includes a preview of the Save Table Style and displays the Table Style settings in a read-only format. You can now save the table along with its settings after placement. The Table Style Manager exhibits all the captured settings, presenting each row type in a different tab. Once table styles are saved, they can be found in the Place Table tool. Update 2023 introduces Esri ArcGIS REST feature and app services for GIS support. You can now utilize online accessible GIS data to incorporate contextual geospatial data in your desktop using the tools provided in the new geospatial context workflow. After assigning a geographic coordinate system to your model, you can attach ArcGIS or feature data to visualize your project within a specific real-world context, such as earthquake or hurricane information. This information is visually represented through CAD shapes and metadata visible in the properties of each CAD element. You can control the data you wish to integrate into the design context, allowing informed decision-making. This latest update brings a productivity enhancement. You can now set the maximum number of elements whose properties are displayed in the Properties dialog. The value can be defined in the Explorer Settings dialog. Maximum Elements field by default, it is set to 5,000 and can be adjusted as needed. If the number of selected elements exceeds the specified limit, no properties will be shown. Modeling enhancements in tools like Cut Solid with Curve and Loft Solid aim to provide users with increased options and flexibility during the design phase. While creating a cut feature on a solid, users can now choose to use the Profile Elements attributes for the feature using the Use Profile Attributes option in the Cut Solid with Curb tool. Turn on this checkbox to apply the Profile Elements attributes on the cut feature. Users can now loft a given profile along closed section elements with guide wires. The option Loft by Sections with Guide Wires can be found in the Loft Solid tool under the Create Solids tab in the ribbon. The latest platform updates in Open Buildings Designer Update 2023 offer improved design workflows, an enhanced user experience with easier access to various tools, and new features for better data control and modeling. 